Hello, my name is Sonnet, and in October, I have the privilege of doing a month long collaboration with KK Crochet, the Spoonie Stitcher, Critters Crochet, as well as Gwyn Spired Crochet. The Decade Divas Party is, well, just that a celebration and a party that centers on yarn and textiles and projects all centered around five specific decades. I will be making one project a week inspired by that week's decade, and each week does have a host creator. The host this week is Critters Crochet, and Critters Crochet has the 1960s. So definitely check out her channel and her 1960s Decade Diva project that she created. The 1960s, probably one of the most iconic decades when it comes to music, in my opinion. And also during this time, we were gifted so many iconic television programs. But when it comes to iconic moms of the 1960s, this witch stands above the rest. And her name is Morticia Adams. Okay, side note, there is a lot of discussion online on whether Morticia is a witch or not. We're not going to debate that here. Believe what you want, whether she's a witch or not, we can all agree she is an icon nonetheless. From 1964 to 1966, the Addams Family television program aired starring Carolyn Jones as Morticia. When it comes to Morticia Adams, she just really is the embodiment of a spooky, but incredible mother and wife. She loves her husband, she loves her children, and she works very hard to help keep everything together. That is why I chose to make her for the 1960s and we're straying away from the crochet this week and working all with felt. You guys know I love to make felt cuties and so when I saw this pattern on Etsy I knew I had to make this one for the 1960s. This is a felt pattern by the creator Kasukas and I just had so much fun making her. She is the smallest of the projects that I made, but she is still so cute, so wonderful. I love her. I just love sitting back with some felt and a needle and thread and creating just a darling little cutie. I feel like she would make a really good ornament. So whether you have a spooky Halloween tree or you have a Christmas tree that you want to have Morticia on, I think she would be really fun. But she's also really cute as just a little felt decoration too for wherever you want to put her in your spooky home. <laughs> but that's it. Just a really quick, fun felt project for this week's decade. Let me know who is your favorite portrayal of Morticia. I have to go with Angelica Houston. She is just so glamorous and gorgeous. I just love her. Oh, so wonderful. But I love all versions of Morticia. But that's all I have to say about that. Thank you for joining me. Be sure to check out next week for our final decade. Stay kooky, stay spooky, and I will see you all a little later. Bye.